Hello guys, we're back. Um, we are back at the house and uh, I just want to show you just a bit of the countryside. What we got here, we got some, uh, this is a pineapple. Wow. Oh, these are still in the ground. Look at that. Oh, these ones are kind of out and growing. Cool, cool. Yes, yes. This is a pineapple field. And, uh... <coughs> what we got here? We got some banana. Banana? Yes. Got more. Got more field on the right side here. This is the papaya tree. It's getting a little bit bigger. Oh, we have a full garden out here, guys. We got little chilies. Oh, more, more pineapple. A lot of pineapple. <coughs> yeah. It's like also, oh, it's like a little mini pineapple field over here. This is the chili field. Oh, this is more, uh, more chili here. This is the lemongrass tree. No more lemongrass. This is what you call a uh, sustainable living, living off the land. We got your, uh, we got your meat and veggies, and also all the fruits as well too. Potato. What else we have here? That's it. No more. That's it. Yeah. So you see guys, you know, you don't have to like, you know, live the American lifestyle all your life. You know, all you need is a nice little piece of land. Um, and then, you know, Invest in, in a few pigs, chicken, ducks, um, you know, start planting seeds on the land and, uh, you know, this is, this is it. This is life, man. You can like just live, live off the land like this. You know, you don't have to work a eight to five every day, you know, slaving, working for corporate America. Who doesn't even care about you when you can just come to the countryside like this? Nice, beautiful weather, you know, all year round, and uh, and uh, you know, just just live life to the fullest. Okay. <laughs> also, too, you know, you're probably wondering, like, hey, hey, Ian, why don't you just like, you know, poop and piss in the in the in the river? You know, why do you need like a like an outhouse? Like, why do you need an outhouse like this? You know, like, can't you just like, you know? poop and pee like right over here well let me show you guys something you know the problem with like uh, pooping and peeing straight off the dock like this is that hang on me me yeah Wait. Okay, so the problem, you know, with like uh, pooping and peeing out in the open like this. Hey, Maka. Like the problem with pooping and peeing like this, you know, out in the out in the open is that you know people will see like, you know, they'll see your shit, you know, like those like when you pull down your pants, 
they'll see your they'll see your junk when you try to pee in the river or like hang on. <coughs> or the other problem is that like you know when you try to take off your pants and then you take a squat like this and you take a shit you know like like people are gonna see your butthole and everything so this is why you have an outhole like this come let me show you what the outhouse you see how nice and secure it is one there's a curtain here you can close so nobody sees you have some privacy so basically if you need to poop you would have to like just sit like this you know and do your business when you're done you have water here you take the water and you splash the water and that's how you clean your butthole and with this as well too if it's raining you're pretty much protected from the rain as well and if you need to pee you just stand pull your pull your pants down and then just pee in the hole and that's how you pee so this is very convenient to have this is a must-have if you guys decide to build uh, like a shack out in the countryside okay like I said poop goes down the river take your hand get some water splash and that's how you clean your butt see look and you can see like <coughs> and the other houses also has the same thing as well too look look my neighbor here has an outhouse as well yeah so yeah guys that's a cool fact for today and um we'll see you on the next video all right i'll see you